The Wilkes College Colonels ran through a light workout today as they practiced with the limited squad during spring break before returning to action on Friday afternoon against Clarkson College. New head coach Jerry Babbitts has enjoyed his new role through the first part of the year. Well, it's a challenge to uh, see if we can get the team back to uh, a competitive level in the MAC. It's going to take a year or two, but we have some good boys who've transferred and we have some good freshmen as well as the guys who are uh, returning lettermen from the last couple of seasons. So it's going to be fun. The Colonels have managed to get in a few games with some pretty good weather in the past few weeks, and that allows the coaching staff to get the team some work through competition. The new head coach says being in the program for a long time is a definite plus. Well, without a fall program here, it helps because I know what the returning players can do. It just gives me more time to spend with the new guys to try to evaluate them. Head coach Jerry Babbitts and the Wilkes College Colonels looking to be competitive and post some pretty good numbers before it all comes to an end on May the 4th. In a wild high-scoring game this afternoon, the University of Scranton Royals raced out to an early 8-3 lead. The game bogged down to a contest of wildness, a total of 30 walks overall. When it was over, the University of Scranton Royals had knocked off Wilkes. The final was 13-6 at Kirby Park. Keep it going. I don't care. Out. 
Yeah, yeah score. The Colonel struck quickly. The first batter in the bottom of the first was Mike Kolbicka. He rips this solo home run to left. It was one to nothing Wilkes. Next up, Bill Evanina. He follows with this drive to left center. It's going, going, gone. Two nothing Colonels. Third up in the inning, Rob Petrick, and he crushes one to deep center field over 400 feet. Back to back to back homers, 3 0 Wilkes. Three batters later, Bill Harries completes the first inning onslaught with his home run to left field. Four round trippers in the inning, 4 0 Wilkes. Kings comes back in the third to get on the board. Pete Patera singles to left. Greg Sacconi comes home on the hit. It's 4 1. Then Lou Chandra with a grounder to short. Tom Hendershot would come home on the fielder's choice. This one was 4 2 in the third. Sid Michaels, Eyewitness Sports. Thank you. 